What's up, man? I got my good friend Ed Golden here. What's happening, man? How you doing? Are you enjoying the show, brother? It's amazing. Yeah, it's great. Great to be around so many passionate people about this industry. It's a, it's a real recharge, you know? Right. Yeah, right. Yearly, it's a great thing to go through. And it's, it's a beautiful time. thing because, like you say, you're around a bunch of gear-minded people, gear-headed people, and it seems like everyone's just so nice and everything like that, and we're having a good time here as well. Yeah. You know what I notice? Locally, there's always the drama between this guy and that guy, or right. his friends, that friend. 100%. You come here and that's all evaporated. It's just, I'm a big fan of any craftsman, right? It doesn't matter if it's a birdhouse or whatever, then you come here, you have people that are all like-minded, all different. It's good for a builder. If you keep your ego out of it and you come here with an open mind, you get to see all these great ideas and these different takes on things. It's it's inspirational. Like you almost sometimes have to block yourself a little from like I don't want to take too much of something I love from someone else. Exactly, you gotta remember exactly. it's a it's a great place to, to And it's to cool because like I always said, the coolest people on earth are musicians and guardians. Because like once once yeah. the, once the craft starts, everyone forgets anything their Anything artistic. I, I look at anything artistic. If I see some okay, so back up. Me, I'm attracted to people who have a passion. I don't care what it is. If you're just passionate about something, I'm into it. You know what I mean? So it's like, you know. So that that to me is so when I see other people's work, I'm, I'm you know, I almost forget that somebody even could be a, a competition to me. I'm just right. like, oh, that's great. And then, you know, it's like that kind of takes down the wall a little bit. And then it's you get the open relationship. And then right. you're like, oh, yeah, you're not just some shop with a name. You're a real person. And, and, and the part is, man, yeah. what I can tell about you is like, even if someone is in the same craft as you, you wish him the best of luck. I'm, you listen, don't, you don't, you don't like. Oh, I don't want him to do better than I'm me. You the, wish him the best. When I first opened my shop, there was a lot of people that I had drama with because we got like a magazine covers right away, and we were doing some TV stuff. And immediately, the <laughs> immediately the reaction is to be like, pull away. Pull away. But I've been the first guy to lend a hand if someone had a problem with a car or something didn't work and there was an issue, I was the first guy to jump in line and that's help somebody. Up. That's what's up. You and know? that's why you where you at. Because like, because well, love and all that. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's you have to... Here's the thing. If you get caught up in the negativity, most of the time, for me, it's customers try to manipulate you against other people in your, in your locally, especially. I mean, sure, on a bigger scale, now, you know, if you get to this level, now you're competing with these guys. But I feel it's more other people. And then if, you know, if someone says like, you said something about me, then I'm gonna, well, I'm gonna say something about you. And now there's a drama that's created between us that somebody else created. So, you know, I think when people put their egos away, and I, I always try to check that. I mean, listen, there's time for it. If someone calls you out, or someone puts you in a position where you have to show your teeth a little, and that's healthy, because I like the competition. But I think overall, I'm such a fan of like when we did some of the car TV shoot, you know, the build-offs and stuff, they wanted me to be against the guys who I respect. Right. They're telling me to disrespect someone who I have a natural respect. They gotta build that drama for TV. That's what they, they do. Think. Yeah. They so. think that's what sells, and yeah. to some extent it does, but. It's uh, it necessarily evil. It's funny because some of the guys from one of the shows we did, I don't mention, but you know, we won, and the guy kept the text from a producer in his phone. He's like, I knew I was going to run into you. Look at this text. It says, Ed's in the office. Call him now and say this and say that. You know, and it was really his way of, you know, keeping our relationship open. And then, like, since then, we became good friends. And, you know, so it's, um, I think it takes. You know, it's like, it's like when you were in grade school, and some of these young, young youngsters won't realize it, but. Most of the guys who beat my butt, they, they became, they matter of fact, KB, now. <laughs> KB, we got into a fist fight yeah. on the football field when we were like nine years yeah. old, yeah. and look, we're both here at C. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah, one of my I'm, best friends I'm not gonna say, I'm not going to say who won, but yeah, it wasn't yeah. me. <laughs> <laughs> you know? I can see you, man. It's <laughs> you know? so. so what's up for Ed? What's, what's up? What's, what's, what's going on? What's, what's, what's in the works? Well, we have, this next year's interesting. There's been a lot of talk of us doing our own TV, and that's been like ongoing. Um, right now, we're just, we have a couple of cool things in here. I don't want to give too much away yet, but yeah, we got we got some cool stuff coming. Right. My, listen, my thing is, we've had a lot of offers to do things over the years. Right. Um, you gotta pick the right one, man. I want to do it my way. I want to have some fun. I don't want to have all. The, I want to try to avoid as much of that fake drama. That you know, a lot of it, the stage stuff is, is cool, and I get why they do it. Right. Everything's expensive and time and, and people doing it with you, but I want to try to do it my way. I right. mean, that's what it comes down to. It and. I think, I think we're going to do some interesting issues. Yo, you know where I'm at? And we're going to drag you up there. Oh, you know where I'm <laughs> at, man. Yo, other, yeah. man. I appreciate it. It's you. a pleasure. Yo, yeah, certainly. You know, Terry, yo, we out. <laughs>